Making coconut milk, ladies and gentlemen, is also very important. We use the milk for seasoning and flavoring of our staple food. All you have to do is look for a ripe coconut. You can tell that the coconut is ripe by its color. It will turn brown like me when it's ripe. It tells me that some of you are not right yet. <laughs> That's the joke. Ask the coconut using this object. We call it mele. Please say mele. In English, it's sharp stick. Say it. Thank you. Japanese, bo. Bo. Put it down here. And this is what you do first. You kill the coconut. You push it down. You be careful. And you keep moving. Okay? So just uh, try to follow two steps like this until your coconut is completely hasty. that in slow motion for your convenience. In Samoa, this is one of the competitive sports record for men three seconds, ladies two days. <laughs> That's why we cook. <laughs> if you want to crack this in two pieces, you have to study the face first. Hope you can see the two small eyes, mouth and nose right here. You are Japanese, you see face? Okay. <laughs> I hope they're the right thing. <laughs> There's a line that runs between the eyes. That's where you hit. You don't hit with the line. You got to hit across the line. And you can use hammers, knives, screwdrivers, dynamite. Some more we use our forehead. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you don't believe it. Do you? you close your eyes. In <laughs> Japanese. <laughs> Anybody try to crack one before? You did? What did you use? Play. Hammer, did it work? How many pieces did you get? Lots of pieces. You share with the family. Okay. And you're from Ohio? Well, that's what I thought. A lady from Canada told me that she put a coffin in the ground and ran it over with a long ball. Young man from Texas pulled out his 45 and shot them between the eyes. While his mother in law was holding. We use this in Samoa. This is a rock. Everybody, please say small rock. Small rock. Okay. You have to remember these things. You, someday you'll you learn how to do this Japanese. Hey, she. Hey, she. Are you sure you're from Japan? Hey, she. There you go. If I don't come out in two feet, don't blame me. Remember, I am a Samoa. This is a Hawaiian coconut. Made in Japan. <laughs> That's a joke. Are we ready? Are we ready? Yeah! And ladies and gentlemen, that's all we have to do. Say the two is drink. Some people call it milk and that's not right. Coconut juice is good to drink. We call it 7-Up because there's no caffeine. <laughs> Never had it. No, <laughs> this is my show. <laughs> Sharp rocks and a lot of different things, ladies and gentlemen. So you, you can get coconuts down real fast. <laughs> you live in Samoa, you can do this anytime you want. We use about 50 to 100 coconuts a day when we make this milk. <laughs> Sing. Okay. That's the right song. Everybody please sing together, okay? Jingle bell, sing. Louder. Oh. 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 Sing fast. Sing. 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 Japan sing any songs you know. Yeah, we use lots of coconuts. And we, when you do this, you can save the shells. You take all the meat out and pull out the fibers from the coconut has to gather the meat. All you do is roll them up and squeeze it. Everybody say milk. Japanese yeah. milk. And ladies and gentlemen, this is how we milk our cooking. Please don't go home and milk your cow the same way. 
It will make them cry all day long. Moo moo. Moo moo. But this is good milk. I made it. You made it.